In this video, we're going to be looking at 2D shapes and all the different types of 2D shapes that you're going to need to know about for your GCSE maths. So 2D shapes are normally determined by how many sides they have. So we'll start off with the most basic, a three-sided shape we all know as a triangle. So there are actually four types of triangle that you need to know about, as I have drawn them all here, and we're going to go through and label each one. So first of all, we have the triangle that has all the sides and all the angles are exactly the same. And this is known as an equilateral triangle. Next, you'll notice on this triangle, both of these angles are the same and the other two sides are also the same. This is called an isosceles triangle. Next, we have a right angle triangle. And you may wonder why it's called that. It's because it has a right angle in the corner. And finally, we have a triangle that doesn't have anything the same. So none of the angles are the same, none of the sides are the same. And this is a scalene triangle. So hopefully you've heard of all those before. But that is all you need to know on those. Next, we have the quadrilaterals, the four-sided shapes. Now the most common is the square. The square has four right angles and all the sides are exactly the same. Next, we have kind of an elongated square known as a rectangle. And then when you take a rectangle and slant it on its side a little bit, you have something called a parallelogram. This shape here is a trapezium. We're going to look a bit more into this in a future video. When you have a square that's been pushed on its side, so all the sides are the same, this is known as a rhombus. It's a little bit less commonly known, that one, so don't worry if you've never heard of that before. And finally, we have a kite. So a kite has these two sides the same, and these two sides are also the same. Okay, perfect. So next, I'm not going to attempt to draw these because it won't end well. Um, but a five-sided shape, you should at least know the name of it, is called a pentagon. A six-sided shape is a hexagon. A seven-sided shape is a heptagon. An eight-sided shape is an octagon. And if you ever struggle to remember that one, think of octopus. Because an octopus has eight legs, just like an octagon has eight sides. Nine-sided shape is called a nonagon. And a ten-sided shape is called a decagon. Now, you're never really going to have to work with nonagons and decagons. Rarely, to be honest, um, octagons, but it's definitely good to be familiar with at least what they're called so that if one does come up, you can at least recognise it. But thank you very much for watching. I hope that helped.